pharmaceuticals. Well, get out, get out. It's your boy, it's your boy. Jeffrey. What up, you guys? Well, 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 well. It's your boy Jeffrey, aka Mr. Lockdown, aka Mr. Mississippi Boy M7 to my lovely lefty. It's Mrs. Lockdown. What up, you guys? Today, how do you <laughs> date in your 30s? <laughs> See, you can't be listening to Zach sometime when it comes down to certain things. Especially this title. He and then look at the expression on his face. Hell no, how do you date in your twenties? That's what he should have went back and got. Mm, now know. that's a madhouse. I'm Russian. not going there. <laughs> anyway, if y'all haven't already hit your subscribe button, hit the notification bell, become part of the lockdown family. And then if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and share it across your social media platform. Also, go to Zach Rush and tell them the lockdown family sent you. Man, let's get right into it. I know this is gonna you be just said in, in this generation. How about mm. that one? See, why you want to add fuel to the fire? I got asked out on a date. I don't know what the fuck to do. I ain't done this shit in years. Are you kidding me? I'm in my 30s now. We don't date. Who dates in their 30s? Most Okay, first of all, Zach is married. Second of all, if his girl asked him on a date and he's acting like this, he more nervous than the first time they went on a date. <laughs> I'm just saying. I got asked out on a date. I don't know what the fuck to do. I ain't done this shit in years. Are you kidding me? I'm in my 30s now. We don't date. Who dates in their 30s? Most people have done got their life like completely figured out by this point. They're married with kids or divorced and they're living their fucking best life. Or, you know, just living wild and free and shit. How the fuck do you date in your 30s? Mm -hmm. I wasn't even good at it in my fucking 20s. Or See? I wouldn't be here. And it's way even worse than that. Now, every person has a crush. I have a fucking crush. Okay? You never expect your crush to even remotely be interested in you ever i woke up this morning and this woman is so far out of my fucking league that we're not even playing the same sport okay <laughs> okay what are you playing ping pong is she playing chess what the hell that is, and neither one of them a sport i don't consider ping pong a sport and this, this woman is so far out of my fucking league that we're not even playing the same sport Okay, I'm playing badminton and she's in the fucking NFL. Oh, now that's out there. I, 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 now that's out there. You I, playing badminton and she playing the NFL. Badminton? I don't play it. Now that ain't a sport. <laughs> Although some do consider it a sport. I mean, some do. It's just a family so event. Far out of You're my right. fucking league that we're not even playing the same sport. Okay, I'm playing badminton and she's in the fucking NFL. I don't know what to do. I, I, I follow her. On social media. And I was just excited at the fact that she followed me back. That was cool to me. Because that means somewhere in the stratosphere that she had seen my face. I thought that was cool as shit. I woke up this morning, got on the phone, looked at it, had a message from her saying, Hey, been following you, love your content and everything like that. I appreciate the support online. We should go have dinner. I almost went into cardiac arrest right there. <laughs> you know what, Zach? Zach. First of all, what happened to uh? That's, that's we talking about this right here. Okay. Second, the cap, the cap, the, uh, <laughs> the cardiac arrest. My wife not already did that with the Undertaker when I took her to see SmackDown. She almost she ran back up the steps just to say, "Baby, I took a picture of the Undertaker with breathing hard." Right. And then the folks at uh, Wally World messed up the fence. We ain't gonna bring um, that back up. We should no. go have dinner. I almost went into cardiac arrest right there. You don't understand. I don't know what to do. Do you ask her what her favorite fucking color is? Or do you just ask her to marry you? She is so far out of my fucking league. And all my boys are married. And they, yo, they've been married for years. They are completely out of the game, too. I'm the last of the Mohicans. Okay. Damn, Zach. <laughs> Oh, Zach. The last of the Zach, you're struggling, baby. Oh, boy. What, what happened? What, what have you been doing? <laughs> For years. They are completely out of the game, too. I'm the last of the Mohicans. Okay? I'm the last one that's not fucking married with kids. They are zero help to me because they're giving me advice that we used in 2009. I don't know what to do. 
I mean, I'm going on the date. I'm not passing up this opportunity. I might be getting catfished. I need to go check and make sure that was her real account that she messaged me from. Because, you know, they do be trying to get some credit card information sometimes. I don't know. what I'm a little bit worked up this morning. <laughs> this don't happen to Zach very often, okay? Because she's, like, really, really, like, tall and, like, fit and beautiful and pretty hair. And she sounds sweet and all this type of stuff. And she wrote me first, so I'm going to have that. Yeah, I'm gonna have that on my mind forever. And then let's say we do kick it off at the first at the first date and everything, everything goes well and we live a happy life, get married and have kids, and then one day the kids are gonna be like, Mommy, Daddy, how'd y'all meet? TikTok. Cause your dad was too big of a pussy to write your mama. So she wrote him. I don't wanna go down like that. You need to get your game up, Zach. Zach <laughs> said TikTok. Zach, you gonna have to you gonna have to DM her back. He was a too big of a pussy. Don't. Yeah, what do you say? Hey, you help Zach. I'm repeating. No, you help Zach out. I, I'm helping him out. I'm laughing at him because he's telling the truth. I just say it. I'm so sad. Ooh, I ain't got to go to TikTok. Zach. Jose. Oh, um, we, we're going to help Zach. Daddy had me. TikTok. Because your dad was too big of a pussy to write your mama. So she wrote him. I don't want to go down like that. But if that's what it takes for me to make, like, to get with her, then I'm in on this because I got to drive like 300 miles in order to go to this date next Friday night that I've already accepted. And I don't really, no, no it ain't next Friday. It's the Friday after that. Uh, I am so, mm. <laughs> like she gave me way too much time to think about this. I'm, I'm starting to smell like donkey. That damn cow licking <laughs> he got two parts ditching his head and then this boy swimming <laughs> up under the head. He is, he is really nervous. He is really nervous. Zay said you gave me too much time. To to think, think about it. I had to do, uh, yeah, I did you like that. You try to renege on me, youngster. It's Friday after that. Uh, <laughs> I am so, mm. <laughs> like she gave me way too much time to think about this. I'm sweating. I'm starting to smell like dumplings. This is not going to be good. Uh, it uh, smell uh, like dumplings. For people in their 30s, uh, don't. Just, just I, I'm just gonna bring an engagement ring. I'm gonna ask her to marry me. I'll buy her a baby cow. <laughs> I'll buy her anything. Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, I need to go buy new clothes. Shit. <laughs> I'm done, bro. I'm done. This man is super nervous. Zach, <laughs> who is this female that got you throwed off like a uh, like a nipsack? Zach, just don't do no. You can do a blazer if you must, but if you're not going to do a blazer, do some nice jeans and a nice shirt, wear your cowboy hat, and scratch it, wear your cowboy shoes, then wear your hat, you know, the one that you see on TikTok all the time in. Damn, that's what got you. I'm helping them out. Oh, take flowers. I ain't got to say nothing else. Like we said in Mississippi, one up, one down. We got music on lockdown. Peace. I don't know what just just happened. <laughs> I'm trying to help Zach out. I thought we here to help Zach. Not hurt Zach.